Bobcats, it's Miss Kilpatrick here, ready for our Monday meeting. Wanted to remind you to be your boy best. How do you be your boy best? That's right. Be brilliant, be exceptional, be studious, and be timely. Boys and girls, it's very important for me to know that you are logging into your Google Classroom every day. Our school codes are located on the school website and on paperwork that was given to your parents when they came to pick up your digital device. Please make sure that you are doing all your assignments from all your teachers. That includes special area. Yep, Coach Hood, Mr. G, Ms. Howard, and Ms. Taylor have some activities for you to do. We need you to do that in addition to your reading and math and science and social studies if, if it has been given to you. Boys and girls, I want you to know how much I love you and I miss you. Hope you're safe. If you need anything, please let me know. I am on School Dojo, and you can you can email me in your Google Classroom, too. I love you, and have a great day. Hey, boys and girls. The time is approaching our first SEL video lesson. We'll see how it goes. We start on Monday. Remember to sign into my Google Classroom. The code is at the bottom. So sign into my Google Classroom so that we can have an interactive class. We will be talking about the circle of control. Over the weekend, think of things that you can control and things that you cannot control. Which ones stress you out the most? We'll talk about that and do some more mindfulness activities. See you Monday. Love yourself. Morning, boy and athletes. It's Mrs. Underdue coming at you one more time with another math moment. This is math tic-tac-toe. So we're going to play just like tic-tac-toe, two partners. Each of us are going to have five cards. On my game board, I have numbers randomly placed here between 1 and 20. So each partner is going to try to block the other and win tic-tac-toe. So this, again, could be K through 5, so we can use addition, subtraction, multiplication, or division. I'm going to be player one and I'm going to look at my card. If you see my cards, I have an ace here and that ace is going to count as one. I do have some jokers in my stack and those are going to count as zero, but I do have no face cards. So I want to try to make a number that's on my board. Hmm. I have two and seven. So two times seven is 14. I'm going to be X and I'm going to place an O here. Now I'm going to replenish those two cards. Now player two is going to be O. Let's see, player two has four and a five. I can say four plus five, and that gives me nine, and that's going to be an O. You will continue the game just like tic-tac-toe. I hope you have a great time with this game this week. Good morning, Bobcat family. This is Miss White coming to you with a lit moment. Do you want to be a strong reader? Well, guess what strong readers do? They ask questions when they're reading, before, during, and after the story. You want to make predictions. You want to make connections. And you want to make sure you understand exactly what the author was trying to get across. So when you're reading, look through the book, just a little preview, make predictions on what that book is going to be about. Can you connect to that story in any way? Maybe the, the problem in the story has happened to you before. Maybe you can identify with that character's traits. They're strong, they're caring, maybe they're scared or anxious. Maybe you have questions on, wonder why the author made this, wrote this story. I wonder why the story ended the way it did. Bobcats, we're counting on you to be strong readers while we are apart. And we want to see evidence of you practicing asking questions when we come back together at school. Bobcats, what do strong readers do? That's right, they ask questions. And when do they ask those questions? Before, during, and after they've read. Good job, Bobcats. I know I can count on you. And are you using Mayan? Are you taking your AR test? You should, Bobcats. Those apps are available to you going through my backpack, and we're checking to see who's being an active reader each and every week. Be on the lookout for our top five Mayan users, or is it top three? One or the other, I hope you are amongst the number. 
Last but not least, Bobcats, what do we do? We stop, drop, everybody read, don't stop. Read, read. That's how Bobcats succeed. I hope you've enjoyed this lit moment. I miss you all very much, and I'll see you next week. Congratulations to this week's top Mayan readers. To access Mayan on the iPads, simply open my backpack, log in with your username and password. Do not put the at APSK12.org. Click sign in. Locate the Mayon app. If the error message comes up, simply click OK and you're logged into Mayon. On Mayon, you have a few ways to access books. You can click on the library. You can see which books are recommended for you based on your interests that you chose at school. You can scroll through the top, go down and see books that are related to books you've already read, and click on the books that way. You can also click on Browse, choose books about different topics, such as animals. There's 1,112 books about different animals, and my goodness, 214 books about pets that you can choose from simply by clicking on it as you scroll through. And finally, you can also do a search. In the search button, you click on the filter on the left. You can search in multiple ways, whether you wanna look for fiction and nonfiction, search by Lexile level, different types of stories or language. So I'm going to choose 100 Lexile and click on the magnifying glass to search. And there's 139 books at a 100 Lexile range. Once I see a book that I would like to read, I can click on the book. Notice it also says take AR quiz. So this is an AR book that you can take a quiz on. Once I click the read button, I now have access to the book. I can start the book. It's not going to automatically start reading to you unless you click on the arrow at the bottom of the screen that represents play. City Train in Trouble. Written by Adria F. Klein. Illustrated by Craig Cameron. And I can go through page by page by turning the page. I am done. Time to go home, City Train said. So we have thousands of books available to us on Mayon. Please keep on reading. We're going to be calling the names of the top readers every